Obadiah 117. Obadiah 117. Yeah. But upon Mount Zion shall be deliverance, and there shall be holiness, and the house of Jacob shall possess their possessions. You see, before you can possess, two things must happen. Number one, there must be deliverance. Because the enemy has held so many people up, tied so many people up. But I command your deliverance. I said I command your deliverance. If you are hearing me, I command your deliverance. I command the deliverance of your husband. I command the deliverance of your wife. I command the deliverance of your children. The deliverance of your grandchildren. The deliverance of your investment. The deliverance of the works of your hand. The deliverance of your body. The deliverance of your finances. I command your deliverance. If you believe it, shout yeah. Then the next thing after deliverance is holiness. This holiness here stands for purity. Tell somebody, purity. Hear me. Blessed are the pure in heart, for they shall see God. So this holiness is not just talking about, you know, being free from moral, immorality. But it's talking about being pure at heart. Because there are people who don't do all the bad things other people do. But they are bitter. Very bitter people unforgiving people mean at heart cold like ice hmm? he's talking about purity a pure heart a pure conscience having your garments always white not walking around bearing grudges bearing grudges some of there are people who never forgive they always bear grudges. They are always holding something against somebody. This year, have a pure heart. Have a pure conscience. Blessed are the pure in heart, for they shall see God. And the Bible said, if you are pure, the next thing after purity, you will possess your possession. May you possess your possession this year. I see you taking possession this year of your possession. In the name of Jesus, say yes.